Hey everybody, I'm Glenn. I'm Xander. And together we are Fun King 3D and we want you to watch real quick this little video. Congratulations to Glenn and Xander at Fun King 3D and the entire family. So what did you win? Well, you already know. The set of Crescent Micro Tools. A Red Devil Putty Knife. And a mystery print that I am not going to disclose until you guys get it. Do with it what you want. But I hope you enjoy it. And here it is. So thank you so much to Ben over at uh, Craig 3D Printing Space. And uh, well, I guess I, I guess some of that thanks has to go to James from Print and Play too for being awesome enough to pick our cool number. And uh, and so here it is. Yeah. You want to do it? You want to do it? I guess I should have had a knife available like this one. Oh, I got it. Sure. This one? Mm -hmm. Always away from yourself, yep. Always away from yourself. It should be able to open. Ooh. Oh. Now, of course, being that you guys just watched that video, you kind of have an idea. Oh, wait, you can't take that out yet. Don't take that out yet. Okay. That's too cool. That is too cool. Being that you guys just watched that video, you have a little bit of an idea of what's in this box. And, uh, oh, that is too cool. Um, I think, I think we may have taken a little damage. Oh. Yeah, there's some parts laying in the bottom of this box. We're going to have to figure that out, but, um, all right, you can go ahead and we'll turn it around. I'll hold it like this though, because the hinges. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like there's stuff inside. Oh. Just, oh. <gasps> you, you actually got two. Look at, oh. you got two. I got a whole bunch This of one, the, the, the hinges use filament. I'm pretty sure that's filament, but... Well, this one too. But. Yeah, somehow the, uh, the hinges didn't make it. I knew that there was too much stuff rattling around in there. It might but we will... Uh, that's got to go to the recycle. We will, we will figure out... I could win a movie ticket. <laughs> I'm I'm more wor worried about. Oh, they slot in. I see. It's a French cleat. All right, we'll be able to get that put back together. That's cool. So what else? Uh, what else? Yeah. <laughs> hey, you got hooked up. It's a rare form of. <laughs> It's a um, wi whisper. The whisp and then whisper. The tiniest bubbles, the biggest taste. But I don't, I don't think that the post office took good care of that. It's a little, um, it's a little crushba. <laughs> and then what I'm guessing is two bags of Teddy Grahams. Oh uh, no, they're probably something more rare than that. These are koalas on the packaging. Ooh. Maybe it's coffee. I don't know. That looks like it's written in Farsi. We have a bun. A bun. A bun. Sea salt caramel. Uh oh. Your mom loves salted caramel. So this Look, is made by the Pearson's Candy two. Company. These guys are actually out of Minnesota. Um, yep, St. Paul, St. Paul, Minnesota. I grew up eating Pearson candy. But look, there's two. Oh, but. there's two. Well, it's one for you and one for Zach, unless you can. <laughs> and then we have another crushed wisp. <laughs> well, it's not quite as crushed as the other one. But yeah, I think the candies with the air bubbles in them. I, I, I think that they, because the um, the arrow bars really took took damage from the heat too. So there's something about the chocolate with the uh, air bubbles with the air bubbles in it, yeah. And those are lots of tools for you to be able to remove supports. Yeah. These would be great for like getting into the into the the tiny little areas for getting support materials out 
the Red Devil putty knife. It's got uh, it's got quite the sharp edge on it, and a nice pair of flush cutters, which are great because I just broke my favorite pair. So trying to cut trying to cut belt with them. So, but this stuff is all wonderful, but these these are just too cool. And of course, we're going to have to figure out how to fix them. It looks, it looks like yeah. There's one missing on this one. Yeah, it's it's here. It's here. Other than that, it's really cool. But I think that I may have to, I may have to like take the screws out and fix them proper. I get two toolboxes. It's to hold all of your support removal tools. So you can do more models with supports. Yeah, there you go. No harm, no foul, Ben. It's all good. It's all good. These are really awesome. Uh, I don't know if you modeled these, um, but either way, it's very cool. This one almost looks like a DeWalt box. Yeah, this one, this one is amazing. I like this one. So, if the top was printed with this filament, it would be the best. <laughs> if that top was printed with this filament? Yes. Is that one too, uh, it's like too, too fluorescent yeah. for you? But well, it's finally cool, yeah! Might have gotten that stuck now. I'm totally not stealing all the candy and putting them in my toolbox. Oh, that's backwards. I'm impressed by these little French cleats because they're not... I have a tendency to over-engineer everything I do. And uh, these French cleats are, are small, but yet they seem to be holding really well. I say that as the other one peels off. Well, I don't have enough room in this toolbox to fit all the candy. <laughs> well, that's because it's not all for you. And then we can uh... Yeah, I could definitely hear stuff rattling around in the box when it when it got here and it was kind of it was kind of scary. You know, Ben, when you sent this stuff, you didn't say some assembly required. You should have sent something that was full of supports that Xander had to uh, had to remove all the supports on it. Well, I have something with supports, but I just never took it off. <laughs> That's that sword, you mean? Yeah. Because I think it's way cooler with the supports. Yeah. It's just it could stand up. Excuses. <laughs> There we go. Those are very, very cool. Well, thank you, Ben. Uh, we're, we're honored to win your, your contest. And uh, Hands off my toolbox. And Xander will be uh, very honored to eat all of the candy that you sent. We really appreciate you doing that. Um, my dental bills will increase, but, you know. My toolboxes. Your toolboxes. My toolboxes. So if you guys haven't checked out Ben's channel, it is, uh, and I'm going to mess this up now, uh, Craig 3D Printing Space, I believe. And I'm, I'm going to cheat and go look and make sure of that. Um, yes, I got it right. Craig 3D Printing Space. Uh, there will be a link to his, his channel down in the description below so that you can go check him out. Uh, he's a relatively new channel. And, uh, and uh, he could definitely uh, use your love and appreciation. So go check it out. You got anything to say? No. Really? No? Nothing? Not thank, like... Thank you for me toolboxes. <laughs> there you go. And the tools. And the tools. And these are, these are good quality tools. Mm -hmm. so, and the candy. <laughs> uh, crescent... I don't have my glasses here, but... Crescent tools are generally made right here on U.S. soil. So I don't know if these are or not, but... But they feel nice. Can't wait to cut some stuff with this. I'll cut some belt and break them. Woo! No, that'd be bad. All right, guys, thank you so much. Thanks for tuning in. Again, go check out Ben's channel. If you like what we're doing, hit that subscribe button. Ring the bell for notifications. A thumbs up is always appreciated.
Then they're probably going to sleep with that toolbox tonight. And as always, print on. Yeah.